And welcome everyone to a brand new episode of Two Super Gamers Playthrough Crash Twin Sanity. Your boys, Zero. And Ennis. Episode number 10. Jesus Christ. That is right. Um, I'm surprised we actually came back to this game, like, at all. After, After the shit we time. went through? I'm yeah, oh, sorry, the shit I went through. Maybe as a safety we should, uh... What? What did what? you just say? You heard what I said. Dude, you made me not play. You said you didn't want me to play it. I'm like, yeah, okay. <coughs> You're right. Maybe we should just do the rest of the playthrough is just you. <laughs> I'll just sit here and stare at the TV. Alright, now I'm just curious. What the hell do I have to do to get this? Uh, you have to sacrifice everything. Oh, oh, they would do that to me. Go for it. Yeah, I will, I We will. just started the episode, so... Why not? Well, I just lost a life. So that sucks. Get you some mangoes. You know what? Every time I see the Wampa fruit now, I just think of mangoes. I kind of want a mango now. Because it's kind of more cylindrical. A uh, cylindrical. More of like an ellipse than in a circle. It is. They kept it vague, though. I love the, uh, that, like, gradient on it, though. This yeah. It looks so tasty. Wow. What the fuck happened? Uh, you hit it from the bottom or, like, the side? Yeah, I guess. I thought those were, like, more bouncy boxes. Bouncy boxes. Yeah, I, uh... I was playing Bug recently. Oh. And I actually realized that that game is basically just the Saturn's version of Crash. It is, isn't it? it uh, slightly different, not as open. But it's definitely close. Oh! And I was gonna say, I was gonna say that it actually, um, it has a lot of problems with me being able to tell how close I am to like an enemy, like distance yeah. wise. Uh, perspective is, um, right. yeah, perspective is not good on, on, on bug, on bug, unfortunately. And that's kind of that's kind of what I think fucked you up over there. Yeah, definitely, definitely. Because you probably thought that you were able to clear, but you went, you li almost went under it even. No, I definitely good. went under it. Like, I I didn't notice. It's just hard. That's why you saw me in the next attempt where I uh, went... I used a sideways view. But yo, we're gonna give... We're gonna give Zero here some, some silence. I don't need silence. What do you think I am? Let me make sure you get this. It's for all the marbles. Hang on. That should... Cause that thing to... Oh. Oh no, I have to actually detonate it myself still. What? Can you look up? Can you tilt the camera up? Yeah, but there's nothing there! Ah. Motherfucker! Ha. Huh. Did I set something off somewhere else? Uh. Was that what happened? Oh, there's a block. Oh! Oh, it's it. worse than I thought. Go for it. I Go have to. Him. Oh, he's I want to see you do it. I can do it. It's just there. We go. Nice. It's a shame. I almost want to see the boxes blow up. They look so satisfying. It does. That's what I thought was gonna. Dude, down there. Look, there's another gem. How the fuck do you get that? That's a great question. Let's go find out. Yeah, guys, this is this is basically me in treasure hunt mode. Do not judge. Nanners is probably hating me right now. I am, but maybe we'll get some. I s that was not a big jump. It that wasn't. Was oh. <laughs> Yo. Yo. Okay. Okay. I'm not gonna blame you if you don't get this one. This is. This looks sketchy. It, it is sketchy, and the perspective fucks with my head even more here. Oh, and also, shit doesn't help that the uh, camera is inverted. The sideways camera, yeah. Yeah. Alright, so this should not be too hard. Ooh! Ooh! I mean, I still have the gem. When I when I touch it, that's it, I have it. Really? Yeah. You check, see? Check, Green just, gem, oh, there right there. I was so say, I don't have to go and do it again. That was fun, though. It was fun to watch. Yeah, no, I actually... I like finding these little things. Now... A few episodes ago, I tried getting that red gem over there. We're gonna do it. 
Don't hate me. What red gem? Uh, remember when we first started uh, near that uh, boat? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I remember that. We were over here, we were talking about uh, Retro Replay. That channel that uh, Nolan North and uh, what's his face? Troy right? Baker. Troy Baker, that's right. Okay, so. Yeah, I remember this gem. Yeah. Alright, so I basically have two chances. Well, not two chances. Alright, let's do it like this. Oh! How? Did you touch it? Yeah, I touched it. I guess. You gotta uh, be careful, you got two. You got two crashes left, and uh. Is that what you're calling them? Crashes? Yeah. But yeah, we definitely recommend you guys watch uh, Retro Replay with Troy Baker and uh. What? What I, I don't. Why? I will not recommend it until they come on this YouTube channel. Oh! That is a challenge. I'm issuing it. <laughs> no, you should absolutely. They're awesome. Uh, Nolan Earth was such a. He's such an awesome guy to meet and just talk to. I, I actually want to meet him myself real badly. Yeah. And so is Troy Baker. Troy Baker, is, he seemed a little tired, so he wasn't very talkative, but it was cool to meet him. And he, uh, he couldn't help but comment about how. I picked uh, something he was he didn't expect to see because I brought up um, Persona 4 to sign. Okay. But now we return to high stakes. Crash Twin Sanity to Stupid Gamers. Okay, he has the gem. He doesn't need to go back, but it would be better if he did. So that would be you know I don't lose a life. That would be ideal. Can he make it? Is he gonna touch the crates? Oh, he made it. Yeah, baby! Nice. Very nice. Alright. I'm gonna do something crazy here. It worked! Right on the edge. It I was worked. gonna say, don't speak too soon. It kind of looks like when you yeah. got up, you may have fallen off, you know? Yeah. Oh, man. Alright, so, uh... Yeah, let's actually continue on with the story now. Yeah, let's do that. I'm actually very satisfied. I am as well. I, I gotta say, I didn't think you could do it. I had my doubts, but uh, I knew you had a better chance than I did, for sure, so... Is that a clear gem up there? It's a clear gem. And another gem! Are we ever gonna leave this level? Are you ever gonna just let me live my life? <laughs> no, no mom. <laughs> oh wait, no, that would make me the mom. Uh, no son. Fuck you, then! <laughs> Alright, and look at that! Oh, that's a- that's not a clear gem, that's a yellow gem. Two lives there, too. Okay, this is gonna be one of the toughies. What I say is really, what is really hard is that you can't see all of this. Nice. There. Oh, cool! Two lives. Nice. Yeah, like it would be a lot easier if you could just pan the camera like freely up and look at it. Uh, How the fuck? Well, I guess. Other side. No. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Whoa. Yeah, yeah, I know where, I know how to get there. It's okay. This is another challenging one. That's all. But yeah, let's go back to uh, Bug. You said you played Bug, right? Yes. Uh, I got the demo disc, and at this point, people should already know why. But if not, I won't say too much more about it. That. But yeah, Bug is a game that I fondly remember from being a kid, right? Oh, what? Uh, I fondly yeah. remember it from my childhood, but I was. I always remember hating it because it was so hard. And I got to play it as an adult. It's like, sweet, I'm I'm gonna. Yo, that may that may go on TSG Versus at some point. Yo! If if it's a uh, if it's a game that's. You know, I'm gonna look it up now. Oh, this is gonna be annoying. But yeah, what what's what what's up with the game you said? Uh, Bug is a four and a half hour game, so no. That's not going on TSG Versus. <laughs> uh, let's see Bug 2, maybe it's short. Fuck! Fuck! I died. Bug 2 is five hours, okay. Yo, maybe we could get it as a playthrough, though. Oh, definitely. Now that we can. <laughs> oh, show! Sure. Um, but yeah, it's a Saturn game. It is a Sega Saturn game. Yeah, that's right, so, uh... Expect that on our channel soon. Yeah. No, I... I love the Sega Saturn, and, um... It's like... It's something that I never got too much experience with, because I've only been around so many, you know? So now that I finally have one of my own, 
I, uh, I can actually play all those cool games. No, indeed. I've only ever been around one other Sega Saturn in my life. And that's when I lived in the, in the Democratic Republic. I had one friend who had a, a Saturn, and he had a, a Panzer Dragoon on it. Dude, that game sells for like $600. Yeah. But this was like back in like the early 2000s. Must that's have nuts. been like 2003 when I went to my friend's house. That's nuts, man. And he had Panzer Dragoon, and I remember turning on the Saturn, and he wanted me to set the date. And I'm like, why? Whatever, I'll set the date. And, uh, yeah. I played Panzer Dragoon, it was fun as hell. Oh, yeah. By the way, I went to a uh, homebrew local mom-and-pop shop for really? the uh, to get a Saturn. Brooklyn Video Games, make sure to check That's them out right. if you're ever in the area. Very cool store. But that's where I got it from. I'm guessing I'm going the right way. I'm hoping I'm going the right way. As am I. Man, these doors... I think I commented on how... Intricate there the doors go. are. Monster, let my brother go. Her brother? Coco. Wait. The voice is out of sync. Yeah. Ruined! Thanks to Perky here. Must be repaired. And only one well, she's frozen again. <laughs> Wait, who's her brother? Crash. Cra oh, they're, they're siblings? They're siblings! I had no idea. Obviously, I've made a few modifications here and there. Quickly! I thought it was like a. Uh... Oh man. I thought it was like a Tricky Kong, Diddy Kong situation. <laughs> uh, no. Uh, they're siblings. Um, Crash did have a girlfriend in the first game called Tanya, or Tana, whatever you want to call her. Pama? Tana. Tana. With a T. Tana! What? Hey, Crash is on. Uh, yeah, I didn't, I didn't actually know. I mean, again, I don't really know anything about Crash, so you can't really blame me on that one. Yes, I can. Fuck you. Um, but, <laughs> that being said... Oh, this is gonna fuck up my head. Oh, that's gonna fuck up my head. Oh, mine's just looking at it. Woo! Hey, do I got all the... Ye oh, just missing one. Yeah. Oh, but yeah, Bug... Bug is very similar to Crash 2 in, in like, its presentation. Mm -hmm. Really good music. And it has... It has edgy teenager humor in it. Really? It does, yeah. Uh, it's, it's a beautiful game. I, uh... I adore that game. Yeah, so we're riding his blimp over to get his niece slash daughter. I love my airship. It's the only way to fly. Hey, so this is how the rich and the ugly fly. <laughs> nice. Get it? He called Cortex I ugly. Damn. <laughs> I love it. Oh, oh, I'm playing as Cortex. You're actually playing against them. Yeah, oh wow, cool. Is this the final boss? No. That was a fun five seconds. Wait. What? Uh. I'm pretty sure. The game glitched? I'm pretty sure we were supposed to be see something else happen. Uh. Well, uh. I'll do my best to fit. If, if anything, I'll put it in post. <laughs> yeah, something weird happened. I'm pretty sure it doesn't just end with that. It definitely glitched. It seemed like a very fast boss fight. Yeah. If anything, it was probably just a little mini game, but I mean, that's what it felt like. Like it would have made sense if there was like two more seconds of it. So there might be a couple missing. I'm pretty sure we were supposed to be another uh, supposed to see another cutscene too. That's what I'm. That's what's yeah. bothering me. Yeah. Because it ended very abruptly. Oh well. This is the next level, though. That's not incorrect. Oh well, we play on. Actually, is it Yoten? I guess. There isn't Do too you... much time left, but. Alright, one second. Let me get. 
No, I want to explode those boxes. Because I know there's something. I'll try. You gotta take the soccer ball. I know. It's Damn a, it, this it's is a, a lot physics more... puzzle. It's not rocket science. Son of a bitch, the ball went all the way that way? And it disappeared. Fuck. Well, you take it. As a former student, Switching over to Nanus. I'm well acquainted with the many secrets this institution holds. <laughs> this this is great. This feels like a very the music's making me feel very mellowed out and the cutscenes and humor are uh, making me feel like I'm watching a fun cartoon. But the gameplay is making me feel like I hate myself. So there's <laughs> that too. And no, I totally glitches. I totally get it. Uh so again, I was thinking about more TSG versus stuff. Mhm. When's uh, TSG versus Cuphead? Oh God! That's gotta happen. I feel like we didn't do the game justice. We did it by just playing it on a showcase. We did not. You yeah. Gotta give that game a full like hour and a half, if not more. That that pe the people need to see us suffer. They want to see us suffer. You bastards! You bastards! Oh my God! They killed Kenny. They killed us. They're trying to kill us. Damn it! You know, Take care of those rats before they take care of you. Oh, they. Oh, don't worry. I I got I got this on on lockdown. I think you remember what happened last time. Yeah. All right. By we, the way, the, the they way you have just, nothing to worry about if the controller is in my hand. You gotta spin them. There you go. I'm guessing. Use the pipes to flush cortex through. Oh. Is it bad? No, what you gotta do is you gotta throw them where that end is. Uh huh. Just throw them in there. Jump circle. Oh, it worked. But he. I like how this time it worked. I'm stuck. The greatest evil scientist in the world. Even though it was off, it was off like several feet. How could things get any worse? You gotta put him through that other pipe. <laughs> what? Lovely. the pipes to flush cortex to the sewer. So yeah, just get get those get those uh mangoes. Do a belly flop. Hit circle. Well jump. Ah I see. That's interesting. Can't do it that way. Now roll him into that pipe to the left. What have we got? Way to go. You've gotta be shitting me. They can't just teleport him back like every other fucking time. I know. I know. Oh, dude, that is that is. Ooh. I'm stuck. Can you skip that? Oh shit! Uh, I'll I'll world. cut through it. Ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba -da. Yeah, it's Nanner's time. How could things get any worse? <sighs> it's not as fun. It's not quite as funny the second time, but it's still pretty good. <sighs> so I gotta roll him into that second pipe. Yeah, right? don't spin him. You just get close to him and just push. Yeah, you just move close to him. Don't, don't, don't let spin me, him. Let me get my delicate gloves out so I could do this at fucking two inches an hour. So the game doesn't lose its shit in. No! No! Oh my god. At least you don't lose a life, but it makes you restart the whole thing. That's annoying. Oh, you don't lose- I thought you, we lost the lives. No, no, no. Actually, before you do that, you see how there's a box there? Yeah. Throw Cortex there. Oh, I actually thought we lost one, so I was really pissed about that. It's gonna restart me, isn't it? No, he teleported, which is good. See, that time he did it, he did yeah, the thing. Yeah, but when he's stuck in that thing, apparently he can't teleport. It's hard to tell. I guess I gotta get closer. Try, try spin throw. So, square circle. I'm gonna also get a little closer. The problem is it's really hard to tell where he's aiming, or he's looking at. Mm-hmm. So, is there a way to reset the camera to where you're looking? No. No, that sucks. Yeah, you just uh, either spin throw or... Oh, that worked! Oh! Fuck it, just, just put him in the pipe. And through the cutscene again, yeah. Uh, yeah, get them fruit. Get that life. 
and just very slowly roll them into that shit. Just, just here you go. The physics on this are fucked. You can use the D-pad though. Yeah, that's a little bit more precise, right? It's just because he's not moving as fast. Oh my god. This is this is this is like performing brain surgery. Damn it! He keeps flipping. I'm worried that he's gonna flip over and then roll out from underneath my Oh god, what'd I say? Yeah. This can't be this they can't be this annoying about this. Somebody should have playtested this and thought, hey. This like, doesn't work too well. Yeah. Kids are not gonna Oh my god. This is a kid's game, kids sure, are not turn, gonna turn turn the camera. There you go. Oh, he's You're actually... pretty much straightforward. He's just got to push forward. The question is, will he go straight or will he turn out? There we go. Okay. Now, turn over. There we go. Okay. All right, so... Keep pushing him through, I guess. Yeah, keep going. Yeah, dude, whenever you, like, do those spins... What? Well, why did you spin it? You said, if you say spin, I'm gonna spin. I swear to God! That's alright, we don't gotta watch a cutscene this time. Um, but Thankfully. Alright, well, we have reached the end of this episode, everyone. We hope you enjoyed it. Um, leave us a comment, like the video, and uh, yeah, let us know. What do you guys, have you guys played any games on the Sega Saturn? And if so, which is your favorite game on the Sega Saturn? Yeah, uh, there are a lot of good ones, even though it wasn't a very long-lived system, it didn't last very long. But, I mean, there are so many classics that come to mind, so yeah, we'd like to know what you think. Let us know in the comments below. Yeah, mine's definitely Panzer Dragoon. That game was freaking fun. Yeah, um, mine would probably- I guess mine would have to be Daytona, but I don't know. There, there, are pretty, there are some other good ones. I mean, Virtua Fighter 2 is also up there. It's tough for me to say. It's one or the other. But yeah, we'll see you guys in episode 11. Till next time, everyone. Bye.